The new year is always packed with sports, college bowl games, and professional and hockey basketball matchups. But once again, COVID is sidelining plans. CBS's Jonathan Vigliotti is keeping score. Here's De'Aaron Fox. This week, sports is providing an escape. But also slamming head on with COVID reality as Omicron continues to set records for new infections. How do sports survive in the time of COVID? I think that's what they're all looking at is basically how can we accept if this is our new normal? Increasingly, the new normal means games postponed or canceled. At least 11 NBA games just in the past two weeks. More than 75 universities have put their basketball seasons on pause. Five college bowl games called off, including Tuesday's Holiday Bowl in San Diego. North Carolina State showed up. We were 100% vaccinated. We had zero uh, incidents with COVID. But an outbreak forced their opponent, UCLA, to pull out just hours before kickoff. You found out that, th that this game was canceled on Twitter. We all felt lied to. We all felt kind of like incomplete in that moment. Like we were ready to do something together one more time and had it pulled you know, out from under us without warning. They need to figure out a way to play these sports that are totally incompatible with social distancing during a pandemic with a highly contagious virus. Stadiums remain packed, but the games may ultimately be decided not just by who wins, but who's left standing. Jonathan Vigliotti, CBS News, Los Angeles.